What up everybody? This is OP at the Serato studio in Brooklyn and today's an exciting day. Today is the release of Serato DJ Pro 2.5 and also Serato DJ Lite 1.5. There's a lot to cover, so let's get into it. There's now official support for Mac OS 11 Big Sur for Serato DJ Lite and Serato DJ Pro. As well, there's support for the new Apple laptops with the M1 chip. But please note that some DJ hardware does not work yet with Big Sur or the M1 chip. So please check the link in the description for the status of your hardware. As well, Serato will have a beta build soon for the M1 machines that supports live streaming. So hold tight. This one is super exciting. There's now direct phase support for Serato DJ Pro. Phase is now supported as a Serato official accessory. This means no more RCA cables. The only thing you need is a USB cable connected directly from the phase receiver to your computer. This improves the accuracy along with reducing latency and drift. In Serato DJ Pro, there's a new mode called WIR, which stands for wireless. When selected, you can use phase wirelessly to control your decks. There are also some additions added with this new integration, which include the following. Remote battery level directly inside of Serato DJ Pro. So now you can see the actual battery life inside your decks. An emergency internal switch, which will automatically switch to decks from wireless or WIR to internal or INT when the battery gets to 5% and also custom design LED animations, which has the remote lights blink when a track is loaded and also starts flashing when the track is at 20 seconds from the ending when you have the track in warning turned on and the preferences. Make sure you update your firmware on your phase device to start using the Serato and phase integration. Check the link in the description for the firmware update. I'm super excited about this next one. There's now offline lockering support for BeatSource Link and also Beatport Link inside of Serato DJ Lite and Serato DJ Pro. With this new feature, you can store up to 100 tracks on your computer to access and play them without being connected to the internet. A Link Pro or Pro Plus plan is required. All of your metadata saves to these tracks. So if you make cue points and loops, they'll appear every time you play those tracks. For example, with BeatSource Link, I can search for a song using the search feature and then drag that song to the BeatSource locker. A download arrow will be next to the song in the locker, so now I can play that song stored on my computer and not be connected to the internet. Please note, these songs are locked, so they can only be played in Serato DJ Pro or Serato DJ Lite. The BeatSource Link and Beatport Link lockers are independent as you need to have separate subscriptions for each and you cannot mix or match songs from both lockers. As well, you cannot record DJ sets with the tracks from the locker. There's now a new expansion button inside of Serato DJ Pro. When you click on it, you can explore and manage your Serato DJ Pro license, your expansion pack licenses, and your subscriptions. If you're not familiar with an expansion pack, you can get a brief and clear description on what it is. The window also allows you to manage your Serato Studio subscription if you're making beats or DJ edits. Also, next to the setup button is a new menu which will allow you to manage your profile, view your products, enter a license code, and log in and log out of your account. This makes the process of managing your account with computers and licenses much easier. If you're a Serato DJ Lite user, you can easily connect your master audio output to your broadcasting software like OBS for live streaming. Inside of Serato DJ Lite, under the Make Audio Available to Other Applications, make sure to install the I Show You Audio Capture software first. Once installed, you can turn on Make Audio Available to Other Applications and in OBS under your Audio Input Capture device in your sources, you can choose the I Show You Audio Capture. This will now send the master output from Serato DJ Lite directly to OBS. From OBS, you can stream to platforms like Twitch, YouTube, Zoom, and others. And last but not least, Reloop has a cool new controller out right now called the Reloop Ready. It's pretty dope. It's built with portability and ease of performance in mind. It sits flush in a 13-inch laptop keyboard so you can practice or perform anywhere. 
There are great features on the controller, including 16 RGB performance pads and touch sensitive platters, which are great for scratching. The Reloop Ready works with Serato DJ Lite, but if you have a license for Serato DJ Pro, it'll work with that too. When using Pro, you can access the new pad mode feature, Scratch Banks, for instant loading of tracks for scratching and performance routines. Yo, we just covered a lot right there. Make sure you head over to serato.com right now and download and install Serato DJ Lite 1.5 and Serato DJ Pro 2.5. Peace.